The holiday shopping season is off and running with a strong start over the Black Friday weekend. MasterCard reports a 14% increase in e-commerce sales compared to a year ago. Of those online sales, more people than ever are using their phones. More than half of Cyber Monday sales were purchased using mobile devices where customers can get access to unique discounts. Retailers can provide them with those personalized offers that consumers are really looking for. Adjusted for inflation, sales at brick and mortar stores actually fell, but experts say that can be misleading. Most shopping still occurs in America inside of a store. Yes, there are lots of people who are shopping online, but we're still seeing greater than 80% of all sales in retail happen inside of a store. The National Retail Federation reports shoppers spent slightly more this year over Black Friday weekend, an average of $235, up $8 from a year ago. The most popular purchases include apparel, toys, gift cards, candy and food, and personal care items. Retailers are also trying out new AI chatbots to help recommend products, but experts say they work better when they learn a little bit about what exactly you're looking for. And that runs the risk of rubbing some people the wrong way. I think there's one major step that needs to happen for, for mass consumer trust, and that's to some degree the chatbot needing to be able to show its work. Amazon and Walmart are among those retailers rolling out AI chatbots on their websites this year. In New York, CB Cotton, Fox News.